Alright YouTube, today I'm going to show you a rather interesting thing that I found you can do with your Xbox 360. I will show you right now. Alright, as you guys know, Xbox 360 comes with a hard drive that you have to, that you save your gameplay, save data. It comes with every Xbox 360 Pro at least, not core arcade whatever it's called right now I have the Halo 3 20 gig edition that came with my Halo 3 edition Xbox 360 I was kinda d disappointed because I wanted the Elite at the time because it had like a ridiculous amount of storage like 120 gigs is nothing compared to my 20 gigs but my parents thought it was too expensive I didn't need that much memory so I just lived with it but then I figured something crazy that you can do to make to turn your Xbox 360 into the ultimate multimedia station ever. All right, so we're gonna walk over to my computer. All right, so we got my computer here, right? And over here, this is the thing. We have an external hard drive. Alright, this is a notebook or a book, whatever it's called. I got it at Best Buy. And this is some mass storage right here. This is about a 500 gig external hard drive. That is a crap ton of memory. Do you know what you could do with that much freaking memory? I got this at Best Buy for about $120, give or take. My parents bought it, whatever. But that is some ridiculous storage. That's how much a 100, uh, 120 gig hard drive for an Xbox 360 would cost. So you're basically paying the same thing, but for like quadruple the amount of storage. Alright, so as you can see, it opens up as my book. I've I have 220 gigs left out of like the 465 give or take 500 that I've already had. And you could open it up and you could have all your backups, video, music, programs, movies. So you can base so you could download movies, music, music videos like by using torrents or any way that you know how to get them. There's another way that you can take your DVD movies by using a program called DVD Shrink you're able to transform your DVD into an AVI file so you can play it on your computer and with that you could put it onto your hard drive and the most awesome thing about it is this hard drive is compatible with your Xbox 360 so right now I'm gonna plug this in I'm gonna start up my Xbox I'm going to show you how this works. Alright, so now I've plugged in my external hard drive. You have to plug it into the wall. Uh, you know, you got to plug it into an electrical outlet. And it is plugged into my Xbox 360. Just to show you. It's plugged in. And now we're going to boot up my Xbox 360. We're loading up the Xbox 360 dashboard. Now we go to my Xbox. And you see video library, music library, picture library, and all that stuff. So let's say I want to play a movie that I've downloaded. Video library. And the external hard drive will come up as portable device. And you see everything that has just been on my computer in the external hard drive. So I'm going to go down to video backups. 
my family guy home videos, movies, I'm gonna go to movies. Now you see all the movies that I've downloaded via torrent or something. And I can run them on the Xbox 360. I'm gonna go ahead and play Iron Man. Play. I'm gonna resume it because I watched it earlier. Alright, so you can I see like it works. It really works. What did I do? I feel like you're gonna pull you over and snuck me. What, you're not allowed to talk? Alright, so I'm gonna stop playing this. And I'm gonna go to. I'm gonna go to music library. Same thing, portable device. Daniel's backups. I'm gonna go to music backups. And let's go with random song right here. I'm going to play for it. I don't know why it takes so long, whatever. I will play almost easy. Play song. Alright, I'm going to stop it, see? With this hard drive that you pay the same amount of money for, a 120GB Xbox hard drive, you have to buy movies and stuff, and you gotta, then you drag it onto it, and you put it on your Xbox. But you could just take this, plug it into your computer, get the movies, rip them, whatever, put them on there, and connect it to your Xbox, and you can stream it straight from there onto your Xbox 360. You can take it to anybody's. You don't have to install anything. It's pretty damn crazy. So, I don't know if it's compatible with uh, PS3 because I don't have one, but try and see what you can figure it out. I'll post a link in the description about how to, like, rip movies on to your computer and stuff so you can put it on there. And that's about it. Stick around for more awesome videos. I... Hopefully, you guys will subscribe. And I will see you guys around.